There you go, it's gone. <laughs> so, that is the end of our long but productive day. All the blocks done and all. No. <clears throat> so, that's the end of that day. All the. Can't talk. Morning. Oh, so, back at it, and tell you what, you'll be surprised because we're not doing a lintel or an extension of that. <laughs> we're um, doing a bit of a demolition day today, so we've got some. Some pretty shabby walls that need coming down and we're going to be replacing them with block so today's task is going to be get all of them demolished ready all the blocks should be arriving today and the we're getting a grab wagon so that'll be coming tomorrow so we need to make sure everything comes down today as well so i'll take you over there so you can come and see the damage There you go, there's one, there's two. So, as you can see, these are very ready for coming down. We've made a start already, that's how much we've took down. Don't even need the, uh, no, tools. no tools, just hand it, because look at this. It's a bit unstable, to say the least. So, and we're gonna take these copings and deliver them to the customer because they can sell them off. These though, straight for the grab wagon tomorrow. So, yeah, do you want to give a, show him a quick wobble? Oh. It'd be better if you show him as well. So, here you go. This is why it needs to come down. I think I'll, a I'll call that a snake wall because it slithers like one. Okay, it's actually fall now. There you go, there's that as well. The other side's long gone. We've been tidied up, so we're going to get that back down to a bit level base and build up off it. We're going to leave the bottom of the wall in. We're putting a 150 hollow concrete block in, straight down the middle. Up to about this side again. Um, three by two concrete flag coping on the top, just like a utility wall, just to separate the gardens. Very nice. It'll be stronger than this at least. Yeah, Alright, so uh, there's the rundown, so we'll get you set up so you can watch us take it down. Probably without power tools. Tie. 
Right, while you're done with that, I'll go. Well, that was fun. Uh, it didn't take much. It's not worth keeping the bricks either because they're all knackered. Yeah. We might get the odd few. I mean, we might take maybe 20 home with us, keep them as spares for patching up, but yeah, look at it, it's just dust. It's doing nothing that. Still haven't found the bottom of the tree. So we need to get all this out of it, out of the way here, ready to go down here tomorrow. As you can see, no chance of getting a skip in here. So we're going to move these bins up and pile all the stuff along this side here, ready for Steve just to come and grab it. But we're, um, we're not going to move it until tomorrow. So it's staying in the garden for today, out of the way. Uh, blocks and copings are coming, we've got sand and cement in the van. So we'll get cleared up and get, get the wall set out today. Give us a good start tomorrow, which is going to be the hottest day of the year. And it looks like we're in the sun all day. Well, definitely all morning. It's going, to be a, it's going to be a warm one. So there you go. Warm wall, gone. I might as well go back and time up for a bit now. We'll catch it a bit. I think I recorded that with the old laser level. If I did, well good. If I didn't, it was time lapsed. I took a level from the top, which is a high spot, traced the level down onto the house, which is a hundred and I'd say that's about 110, 120 mil pig in it. So we're gonna cut the bricks and level this up with bricks and then start the blocks on top of that. So it'll be 120 to nothing. There's not really much at all in the middle because it sort of goes up and along. No wonder the wall was wonky. So yeah, this is the long side, we've got the short side to do next. So now we've got our, our course of pig that we need to put in. We'll get this side knocked down, work that one out, and we'll probably put half a mix in and get it all levelled up. Hopefully by then we'll have some blocks and maybe get a course or two blocked down. So yeah, that's it. I'm just gonna still saw that off. Because the blocks the block the wall's gonna sit here. Centre of the old wall, centre of the, uh, the foundation. That's solid down there. So yeah, that's it. That's one side down and uh, levelled up. So let's head over the other side.
Fairwoods have arrived with the blocks. So we'll just get you set up while you watch his, uh, his crane skills at work. Yeah. So there'll be three packs. Brilliant.
All right. Here's after lunch. All these blocks are loaded out. It took an absolute beating on us, <laughs> but they're all out. So Dad's gonna get Arthur mixing because Steve is actually gonna come today to get this uh, load taken away. So we'll just get Arthur mixing so we can definitely use that up. Because if obviously when Steve arrives, we need to get all that and all the other crap just got in there as soon as possible. So that'll be the plan. Dad's getting that. Okay, it's done that mix, so the plan is we're going to try and get the pig done so that when we do start the proper block work we can just get it going then as if, uh, as if it's on a regular Change your mind, we're not using bricks to put the pig out and then put blocks down and we're going to need a few blocks to pick them up Well there you have it, we're not using bricks So we're going to set the line up, the level line there and put these splits in and then that's it then, we've got a level line to work on both sides I should have thought I had to some splits Hey. We should have thought ahead and ordered some splits. No, no, it's a six inch block, isn't it? So oh, yeah. The height will be too, either too thin, too wide. We've cut the blocks, it's the right width wall, isn't it? Straight off the back. There you have it. So, I'll get you set up again, and that could be Steve. So, be Steve now. see you in a minute. So there we go, Dad's got the pig in on this one, so now it's just a case of get the other wooden profiles set up and blast these in and we're gonna get our new our new fits bricks. We'll get them in tomorrow so we can give them a, a spin. And now I'm just gonna get on the dad's gonna get on the other side and we'll be ready. I'm in the shade. We're in the shade, yeah. It's about 10 degrees cooler now. It's a bit of a drag today with this uh, temperature, but we're making progress. Um, Steve should be here, uh, yeah, for us. So, two jobs to do in, in Liverpool and then heading up to So we've got an hour, roughly, from now, because I think it's about three o'clock, so all that'll be gone within two hours.
And there you are, Steve's here. So let me just get you on here. Let's get you around. There's our pile. So obviously, we're gonna be getting that brought out for us. It's excellent, as managed to get this done today as well. So, get you set up. There you go, it's gone. <laughs> there he goes. And there you are, there you go. Looks like we wasn't even there. I'll take you around. That was a mad hour. <laughs> yeah, it was. Dad's a bit dead. Moved all them bricks by himself. I, I barred them, but he's the one who shifted them all into the barrows, so. But there you go. That's all them bricks moved. Now some of the crap has been left here because there's lots of green in it. Some garden waste and obviously you can't, you can't mix that so we're just going to bag that up and take that home with us. The bulk of all that rubbish is gone though which that's a lifesaver that so we're just going to get this sweeped up into piles, wash the mixer, joint up and get out of here. That's a good day that. Wheel down, pig set out, shit, shit gone. All the blocks loaded out. Hey. All the blocks loaded out. Set out, loaded out. Well, this will be the end of this video then, won't it? The next video will be putting them up. Or are you going to put it all in one? Um, you can have a part one and two. Yeah, I think we'll see how it goes. You can have like a demoli yeah, sure. demolition page, a uh, demolition video, up vid building video. Yeah. Separate them. Yeah. Get the. Because obviously then the thumbnail can be better then. I can have one for demolition and one the pile of bricks and then two the, w the work going up. Yeah. Anyway, and that is the end of our productive day. Bloody hot one, but we got a lot done, so we're happy with that. If you enjoyed, be sure to hit that like button because that's greatly appreciated. And if you're new to the channel or you want to see more, be sure to hit subscribe and tap that bell so you're notified when we upload. Again, we really appreciate that. It's a massive help for our channel, so thank you very much. This has been Brooklyn with Steve and Alex, and we'll see you when these go going up.